Good morning everybody, it's me Monster Matt 345 here and I have got a new energy drink review and it actually is an energy drink review for Monster which is good on a channel called Monster Matt 345 um, and today I'm going to drink the Monster that is um, Lewis Hamilton inspired Monster Energy's Lewis Hamilton 44 I guess um, <coughs> I have been um, I was trying to save off the 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 sort of sport there in, in, in the UK there's um there's sports inspired monster um well like sports men inspired monster there's this Lewis Hamilton one Lewis Hamilton is a uh, a motorsport driver he drives in the biggest uh, <coughs> biggest sort of like motorsport competition in the world Formula 1 and he's very very successful I think he's like a um this can says he's a three time champ world uh Formula One world champion. I think he's like a five-time Formula One world champion at, at, at this stage. Um, I, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, okay. Sorry, sorry, sorry. So there's two monsters in Europe that are based on, that, that, that are sort of like uh, based on sports stars. There's this Lewis Hamilton one. And then there's also one for the famous motorbike rider, Valentino Rossi. Now, I may still do this at a later point, guys, but I have a friend who is obsessed with motorsports. He's loved motorsports his whole life, and I was sort of ho hoping I could, um, hoping I could hold off the review of, um, <coughs> of both of the motorsport-inspired ones until I could get a hold of him and get him into my, and in, 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 into my room and acclimatize my channel and we'd make a wee video together, but I haven't told him about the channel yet. I feel like it probably would take a, it'd probably be a few months off until I do that that sort of thing so I thought I'd review it today see how I get on and then maybe in the future we'll do a yeah we'll do another review together or we'll review the Valentino Rossi one together or something along those lines anyway um but today I have it here it's seven in the morning I'm so tired guys I've got a long day ahead of me today <clears throat> so I thought that I would just uh, I'd just review this while I have it here now in my hands and um, I can do it with my friend at a later date. But yeah, Lewis Hamilton, he's a sports star. A couple of years ago, he teamed up with Monster. I think he had the Monster logo on his helmet. Um, designed his own drink that's available only in Europe. Um, it's not, uh, it's the same as the Valentino Rossi. I don't think him and Lewis Hamilton are famous in America at all. So there's no point in bringing the drinks over to there. <laughs> <clears throat> um, sorry, I think I'm catching a bit of a cold here. Some of it off again today. Sorry about that, guys. Um, but yeah, I, I, I think that um, it, there just wouldn't be much point in bringing this out in America. In the same way, there's this sports star in America called Gronk, who's like a... I almost said... <laughs> I almost said a rugby player. He's a foot, American football player, and he's very, very famous, and he has a monster out in America, although I think it might be discontinued now. Hopefully we'll get to try it before it completely fades away. But, um, you know, the Gronk isn't available in the rest of the world because he's only famous in America. So it, it kind of works both ways, you know. But um, personally, like I say, I was going to get a friend involved in this because he knows a lot about motorsport. I don't know that much. But I know Lewis Hamilton is like a five-time world champion. My dad loves Formula One. He watches every single race without fail and has for, like, pretty much my entire life. So... He's probably watched Formula One for at least 25 years. Uh, no no word of a lie. You know, probably a lot more than that, to be honest. Um, ironically, and it might be because we're not English, obviously we're Northern Irish, as you can hear from the accent. Ironically, he really, really hates Lewis Hamilton. He's not a fan of him at all. <laughs> um, <clears throat> he sort of cheers him on to lose every single race he's involved in. But um, it, it, it is what it is, you know. I, I think he's very, like... Um, I think people think he's kind of full of himself. I think he like um, is a sort of like almost tries to transcend the transcend the sport as like his own kind of like crossover star. And I think some people just don't don't like it don't like his attitude. But I mean, I don't know the guy. <laughs> I, I don't know the guy. I think it's good to see people from the United Kingdom being successful in sports. So I've got nothing against them at all. Um, and he actually has delivered a pretty a pretty good monster. You know, it's one of those ones I feel more fondly about it whenever I'm not drinking it. As weird as that sounds, um, and whenever I am drinking it, I'm like, ah, this this is okay. You know, one of those one of those there sort of things. But look, we'll read the description. We'll crack it open. I'll talk a bit more about it. 
Um, it is a full sugar monster, the same as the doctor is, and maybe that's why I don't drink it very much, because I do tend to stick to the ultras. Look, I'm a big, 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 big believer that people should be allowed to... <coughs> people should be allowed to drink as much sugar as they want without being punished for it, you know? Um, and uh, But I, I do tend to stick to the ultras myself and only use the sugary ones as a treat, so I don't have this one too often, but we'll... We'll explore this together. I've talked enough for five minutes straight about nothing here, so I'll I'll get to it. Sorry, guys. Um, this is very very um, yeah, uh, uh, Is that a word? Um, it it very very it sucks up to lose a lot. <coughs> Monster energy. When your three-time Formula One world champion Lewis Hamilton, life moves at fifteen thousand RPM. Whatever that means. <laughs> now I really wish my friend was here. And 200 miles per hour. A man who exists in a world of milliseconds demands a drink that can keep up. When we partnered with Lewis to create... 44. Our R&D team worked flat out to engineer the quickest monster ever. Light, crisp and refreshing with a fast finish. It gets you out front and pulling away and look they got little... They've got a little signature there. They've got um, they've got Team LH. Very, very, very um. I don't know. It's just very, very. They they love Lewis Hamilton. Obviously, it's his drink. To be fair, you know, and um, <clears throat> I don't know. It, it is kind of exciting. And I think I remember seeing this drink and thinking Lewis Hamilton has an energy drink. That's so cool. And I think it's it's not just the fact that it's a sports star with an energy drink. It's the fact that it's a sports star who has teamed up with literally the most popular energy drink brand in the world, it would be like, um, my goodness, it would be like if, uh, I'm trying to think, it would be like if Tyson Fury did his own version of Coca-Cola, you know, it's just, it's just very, very cool, and I find it really, really, imp <laughs> wasn't, it wasn't the best example, I'm sorry guys, but look, we'll, we'll crack this open here, you, you get my point anyway. Now, one of my friends, he said to him, this is Monster's attempt at doing their own version of Red Bull. <coughs> and I think, I mean, we'll give it a taste test here, but I think he's sort of not too far off it, to be honest with you. You get the smell, you get that traditional kind of, like, energy drink smell. I'd say that cheap energy drink smell, to be honest with you. Um, and uh, it's just this kind of, like I say, traditional energy drink smell. It does smell sort of like Red Bull, so I really, really do get where the comparison comes from, but it's different whenever you taste it. It's really different. Mmm. It's really, really, really hard to describe it, to be honest, guys. I mean, it is... I'm sorry. It is like, um... It is like... <coughs> I don't know how to explain it. It's not like this really, really fruity taste. It tastes like a an energy drink. It tastes like a traditional energy drink that isn't... You know, I, I've said about this before, guys. Some of the, like, the ultras, I can just chug them. I can just drink them down and um, enjoy them so, so quickly. Or some of the, um, like, the likes of Original Monster, the likes of Red Bull, it sort of has a flavour that's almost... I, I don't want to say it's offensive, it's a nice flavour, but it's just something that can't be chugged and drunk immediately. It sort of sits with you for a while, um, it's something to be sipped on instead of, uh, instead of enjoy, you know, like, a, in, instead of immediately guzzled, basically, <laughs> like, like I do with a lot of energy drinks. So, <clears throat> the flavour is, it's kind of that, like, artificially sort of, um, traditional energy drink flavour. I, I, I think it's kind of, it's kind of insulting to say that it's like a cheap, it tastes like a cheap energy drink because it doesn't, it has this really, really like rich flavour with lots of notes. But to be honest with you, it's so, so hard to describe it. Um, some people have, like, I, I've sort of seen it this way. Hmm. Sorry, guys. Sort of seen it in the way, like, it's almost like... It's almost got this like white grapey sort of flavour. Um, it kind of tastes, yeah, it kind of does have this like white wine taste to it. 
<clears throat> I mean, I, I don't drink white wine a lot, guys. I, it's not something I have very often, but I do get that. It, it just, it, it doesn't taste, it doesn't taste incredible, but you sip it, you really get this nice bit of energy. It is light and crisp. I do feel refreshed already from drinking it, and I don't get that with all energy drinks. Um, so it is nice, guys. Don't don't get me wrong. It's just, you know, there's lots of sugar in it. There's, uh, it's hard to distinguish the flavor, and it's just something that like um, oh my goodness, it's so so hard to describe. So this is an even more scattered review than usual. I'm so sorry, guys. Um, <coughs> but uh, I'm sorry for the throat clearing too. It's out of hand I'm sorry about that um but I mean the to me the closest thing I would describe it as is tasting like is, is Red Bull if you're American if you don't drink this I would say don't be too upset guys you know you're not missing out on a massive amount um it kind of tastes like if you got a big can of Red Bull and but it has a bit of a a stronger sort of a stronger more intense longer lasting flavor to it um i'm not the biggest fan of it it has a time and a place though i know i say that a lot for drinks i don't like but sometimes you just feel like drinking this and it, it it's good at the time you know um so look I'm, I'm gonna i've rambled on long enough i'm gonna give this lewis hamilton energy drink energy drink a 2.5 out of 5 i think that's fair it's sort of in the middle um it's not awful, it's not incredible, but I will, like, I've said it again, I'll probably finish this, and in about a week or two, I'll be like, I would really, really love a drink of that Lewis Hamilton energy, energy drink right now, and the cycle will repeat itself, it's always been that way with this drink for some reason for me, but um, I'll leave it with that, guys, two and a half out of five, solid energy drink, good addition to the monster range, um, but not something to be overly upset about not having. Um, it's going to take me a wee, wee while to finish this, <laughs> but look, <clears throat> this has probably been my longest video ever, I'm sorry for being even more incoherent as usual, I probably will try and get my friend on board for a video in the next couple of months, so we'll revisit this again, we'll see somebody else's perspective, but for now, um, yeah, I think Formula 1 starts in about a month's time, and Lewis Hamilton will probably dominate it all over again. <laughs> um, you will need a Lewis Hamilton 2 energy drink. He'll become that famous. But anyway, guys, thank you very much for checking out the video today. I will speak to you all again after a while. And take care of yourselves and have a great week, okay? Thank you. Bye.